Maple Sun systems which are bidirectional systems are classified as afferent reservoir system and efferent reservoir system based on the placement of the reservoir bag in the circuit. Afferent limb is that part of the breathing system which delivers the fresh gas from the machine to the patient. Efferent limb is that part of the breathing system which carries the expired gas from the patient and vents it to the atmosphere through the expiratory valve. If the reservoir is placed in the afferent limb as in maple sun A, B and C, they are called afferent reservoir systems. If the reservoir is placed in efferent limb as in maple sun D, E, F, they are called efferent reservoir systems. The summary of characteristics of the six maple sun system are laid down here. This table shows the fresh gas flow requirement for each Maple Sun circuit. Maple Sun A is best for spontaneous ventilation. Maple Sun D or Bain circuit is best for controlled ventilation. Maple Sun B is obsolete and C is rarely used today for emergency resuscitation. It is replaced by an AMBO bag. Maple Sun D E and F require higher fresh gas flow to prevent rebreathing. They are next in order of preference list for spontaneous respiration. But they are better than Maple Sun A for controlled ventilation. Though individual Maple Sun circuits have their own advantages and disadvantages relative to each other, the Maple Sun system as a whole has certain benefits and drawbacks compared to other circuits like circle systems. These are laid down here.